Okay. Understand? Mm. I'm off to the farmers to pick up uh, a heart and some liver for the dogs. Seems he just may have butchered one yesterday or today. I don't know. But we're going to go and see what we can do. And I'll bring you along for part of it. We'll see what we can do. I just got to go in the garage, pick up a bucket. I got my sister in law, you know, all coming for a, a little stay overnight. It's colder than hell out there. Okay, on with the chapeau. I got you on the selfie stick. I don't know how that's going to work out. If you're driving and all. Oh, it's colder than hell out there. So he asked me to bring something along to put the stuff in. Let's go and get ourselves a bucket. Okay. Oh, there's one over there. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. Hang on here. Let's go get one. Get one that with relatively little dirt in it. Here. Don't fall off. Alright. Once we get it, hopefully the bucket is big enough to put everything in. Oh, good. Oh, there, the Jeep just shut off, so it should be nice to get into. I just put the wipers down. Oh, put the bucket in. Leave. Move the seat back. There, that should steady that up. Oh. Somebody coming through with his doggy. All right, it's a good thing I did this yesterday. feels nice in there. This is a brilliant gas wasting a great idea. Okay, let's get in. Oh, oh what a time to want to pee. Instructions. Here we go. Heated steering wheel. Yep. Temperature. Somebody's been playing with it. Climate. Synchronize. Ah, the mother-in-law. Check to make sure she didn't frig with the uh, the vents. No, she did though. Good, busy little fingers there. Okay. As you can see, she's uh, nice and fresh. 
And we got a storm a storm warning coming. I gotta put the seatbelt on. Hang on. Yeah, boys and girls. We're gonna have a late Christmas after all. We got a storm coming. Wednesday. 15 centimeters, whatever the hell that is. That's a couple of inches, so that'll, should help with the uh, driveway, we'll, uh, oh, there's deer tracks right here, look, get out of my driveway, they crossed right there, there's, uh, I think two deer, but I'm not really sure, maybe there's three, I don't know, doesn't matter. So I'm hoping to uh, have another live video here for, uh, within the next few days. Well, I have to pick a day when the wife's happy because I wouldn't want to put her on the camera. Not that she would, but she agreed to come, so we'll see how it works out. For those of you that don't know us all that well, which would probably be pretty well everybody. Let's just say I can be a handful. And I'll leave it at that. I always mean well, though. Generally. I don't know if you can see anything out the back or not. I just got the, win the window off. And she doesn't like running the, uh, oop, wrong one. She doesn't like running the wiper on the dirt road. For whatever reason. That drives me freaking insane. Because if you, as you can see how it's filling up with snow, it does the same thing with dirt. Or dust or whatever you want to call it off the, the road. And uh, what happens is when it gets wet, it leaves a real big mess on the back of the window. So, as soon as you go to go to, go to the city or wherever, you start driving down the road, it's a big freaking mess. But, uh, I'm turning you around a little bit here for now. So you can see what I'm seeing. So we head on down to the farmers here. We're going to pick up, uh, hopefully, a pile of meat. to the house here, I guess. Oh, it's a good thing I moved over. We could have had a freaking near accident there. And he's been doing rentals on his house. He's done pretty good. He's doing something fancy over there. So what I'll do is I'll put you on pause and then until I come back. Okay? See you soon. Okay, we're back. We got, I don't know if you can see that or not. We got a, I got a bucket of worth of work to do here. They just sold two horses.
And there's this, uh, he's rebuilding his barn. He's got a sawmill down there. He's uh, raising Highland cattle, and they butchered this guy yesterday, a big, uh, big bull. And he's going to use the white one, the little white one there, as his uh, new breeder. Okay, here we go. There are all kinds of traffic on here today. It's odd. All right. He's been working hard. He's got to be the two of them there, the hardest working people. Let's see here. I think it's, whoops, there they are down there. They still got a horse. They sold the horses because she guys, I guess she was afraid of them. So anyway, I got my work cut out for me now. We gotta chunk that meat up a bit. Wash the bucket out boil it all up and then dice it all into chunks for the boys and uh, we're good to go there. That saved me a few bucks. So here we are. This is, uh, woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. we got to pay attention. We'll give you the old, let's have a look-see here. There's not a ton of decorations up on these trees, or these houses. There'd be a little. We got uh, minimal. It's not like folks in the city. I gotta go to the city on Wednesday, and that's when the storm's coming in the afternoon. It's going to hit the same time I get my booster shot, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And uh, the weather guys don't usually have that too bang on, so it could be noon or it could be 6 o'clock, but it'll be sometime around there anyway. And I think 15 centimeters is 2.5 centimeters, 2.5 centimeters to uh, an inch. So whatever that is, Let's see, 15, that's 35 inches of snow, that's enough. It's worthwhile going slow through here, you can still see water running in the ditch. That's probably springs. I don't know what they were doing to the bridge here. I think they just put those markers on there. But you can see down in here the creek. This is the North Forks. I don't know if it ever does freeze solid or not. But uh, this piece of property here with that barn on there, that should be coming up for sale before too, too long. And uh, then there, there's another piece of property before it hits mine behind this house here or this camp. There's about 98 acres on this one minus the two camps. And then down there, look, you can see all the deer tracks coming up through there. We won't see this guy too much. They'll come out here, well, probably spring again. So now we got to deal with the little woman there. We can panic here. Oh, good, the snow, the snowman stood himself back up. I 
and I'll have to come out and shovel it off. But I got you, I got you on the selfie stick, so that doesn't work out too good for uh, videotaping and shoveling. Let's see, I'm gonna get back here far enough. All right. So after this, we'll open up the garage door. out for my gloves here for a while. The boys will be into that. Here we go. Let me see here. How slippery it is here. Oh, it's not bad. Nobody's going to break their neck on that. Put my gloves on. Let's get this bucket out of here. Actually. Oh, and because the storm's coming, I think I'll lift the wipers up again. <coughs> Beautiful day, the birds are chirping. It's about minus 15 or some damn thing. It's cold. Okay, that's done. Guess I could have come back a little further. There we go. Perfect. Thank you. Fresh killed yesterday. Three o'clock, he, he said. Here. And, sorry for the short video today, but uh, I got to take care of this critter here. And we got to get this thing boiled and uh, cleaned up so the dogs can enjoy it. So once again, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and we'll see you right away, probably again tomorrow, maybe later today. Who knows? Bye-bye.